subscribe to drama yt and press the bell icon to get the latest videos first of the all hey guys how are you i am k2 and welcome to drama yt after watching a number of good sea dramas now i am confused what to watch next if you have the same question then you are at the right video this is the third part of the video series where i am listing the most popular sea dramas you should watch do check out the previous video as well so now without further ado let's get into it The Blue Whisper Part 1 Ji Yoon Hee is a powerful and talented spiritual master living in Flower Valley. She loathes the deep dark secret that restricts her from exploring the world at her leisure. Chan Gi is a merman who appears in the valley courtesy of the cruel princess Shun Dae. Her royal highness commands Ji Yoon Hee to make the merman speak human words, cut his tail, give her his pearl and be loyal at the same time. But there is a catch. Yoon Hee must enlist the aid of Lin Hao Shing, her adopted brother and sworn enemy. Keeping company with the Mamen has Yoon Hee becoming closer to him. In time, she will have to make the fateful choice between Mamen's freedom and her very own. Immortal Samsara Part 1 Yandan is the sole descendant of the ancient tribe, the four-lived lotus. Yandan's entire being is a treasure trove of medicines. She and twin sister Ji Shi transformed into human form a century before while attending the queen mother's feast but yandan faced the greatest trial of her life the love trial falling in love with lord ingwan resulted in her wasting the following 900 years trying to forget him such a high price to pay now the supportive yumo enters her life encouraging her daily to perform good deeds while punishing evil they encountered lord ingwan's current reincarnation tongso the demon hunter They assist him in his quest to locate the four ancient artifacts, then uncovering an even more mysterious secret. Can they try or find the evidence they need despite the dangers? Mr. Bad, Nan Shing is an online novel writer whose main character is based on her idol Lucy Shen. The main antagonist is Xiao Wu Di, a cunning and manipulative martial artist. One day, Nan Shing makes a wish for an unforgettable love in a fairy pool. To her surprise, Shavudi the villain of her story suddenly appears before her she tries to avoid him but Shavudi finds her and then threatens her into taking care of him unfortunately for him Nanshing's face comes with a special power whenever she needs help Shavudi teleports next to her to fulfill her wish legally romance at 28 years old Shan Wei should have been well on her way to establishing herself in her career however working as a paralegal for Lu Xun has so far proven to be anything but awesome harboring a grudge that dates back to their days as students lujun has made sure shan wei's life is nothing short of a living hell but when shan wei becomes the victim of a tragic accident everything suddenly changes now in coma shan wei finds herself in a dream world in which she has reverted back to her teenage self it is here in the world within a world that she finds a very different lujun meeting him in this dream world Shan Wei discovers an entirely different sides of her personality boss. A dream of splendor. Zhao Panar is a smart and savvy tea house owner in Shantang, living alongside her two best friends, Shun Shangyang and Shan Yizhang. When she finds out that her fiance left her for another woman of a high ranking officer after becoming an official in the capital of Bianjing, she refuses to give up into her fate and decides to travel to the capital in search for the truth. On her way there, she crosses paths with both of her best friends, whose lives she saves, and then they follow her onward. Gu Xian Fan is a commander in an elite capital squadron, nicknamed Living Devil. He is set up by very people he swears allegiance to, and must find out the truth behind a nefarious scheme involving the imperial court. When he first meets Zhao Panar, they don't see eye to eye. However, this intelligent businesswoman has caught his attention, and as they help each other. they get closer to their own goals once arriving in the capital zhao panar her two best friends gu xian fan must weather many storms together and apart but will their strength care for one another and share preservance by relying on their own ability to make a small tea house they open in the largest and most successful restaurant in bianjing and will they each get the love and happy ending they also desperately deserve so that was it guys the video in here i hope you have liked this video If you have watched the video till here just give this video a like and do subscribe to Drama YT 
and yet you guys have not follow me on the instagram handle which is right in front of you as well it is at the rate nachiketa triple five do follow me there as well i will see you later as always love peace and hugs it's really been a pleasure